disclaimer, all the contents published in this channel is meant for educational and entertainment purposes. All the information, whatever you see in this YouTube channel, are based on collections from various reliable sources like newspapers, TV news channels, websites, online educating platforms, etc. This channel doesn't intend to hurt the sentiments of any viewer and does not promote or encourage any illegal activities. All the decisions, choices, interactions, likes, comments, etc. are the responsibility of the viewers. I will neither bear the responsibility of any decision, choices, interactions taken by any person, any viewer, nor of any positive and negative outcomes relying upon the information provided in my videos. Hey all, welcome back. I'm Sugeet. I make videos on general studies and current affairs. Let's begin. Which country has cancelled the hosting of APEC Forum COP25 Summit this year? Conference of Party 25 Summit this year. It is Chile. Chile has withdrawn. President of Chile, it is Sebastian Pinera. Capital of Chile, Santiago. Which country will host the second assembly of International Solar Islands? It is India, New Delhi. Headquarters of International Solar Islands, Gurugram, Haryana. Chief Minister of Haryana, Manohar Lal Khatta. He has won again and he is from Karnal constituency. Who has been appointed as the first lieutenant governor of Ladakh. As we know, on 31st October, two new union territories have been formed out from the single state human Kashmir. On 31st of October, that is Ladakh, Leh Ladakh, and Juman Kashmir. Lieutenant Governor of Ladakh is Arki Mathur, Radha Krishna Mathur. Lieutenant Governor of Jammu Kashmir is Murmu, Girish Chandra Murmu. GC Murmu or Girish Chandra Murmu. Who won Argentinian presidential, presidential election by defeating Mauricio Macri? It is Alberto Fernandez. Alberto Fernandez. G20 summit 2018-19-20 were and will be held in 2018 was held in Argentina, 2019 was in Japan, 2020 will be in Saudi Arabia, 2021 will be in Italy, and 2022 will be in our country, India. Political advertising has been banned by which social media platform recently? And it, it, it will be enacted soon and it was Twitter. CEO of Twitter is Jack Dorsey. Jack Dorsey. National Unity Day is celebrated on 31st October because it is the commemoration of the Iron Man of India, Sardar Vallabhai Patel. He was born on 31st October and National Unity Day is celebrated on 31st October. Remember, our former Prime Minister Indira Gandhi has also been left as she passed away on 31st October. World 35th Summit of Asian Association of Southeast Asian Nations began on 31st October. It was in Bangkok, Thailand, and its theme was Advancing Partnership for Sustainability. World's oldest living test cricketer, Aileen Ash, belonged to which country? She belongs to England. Vyasa Man is given by which foundation or organization? It is KK Bella Foundation. 28th Vyasa Man 2018 was awarded to whom? Leela Dhar. Leela Dhar Jaguri for her poetry work, Jitne Log Jit. Utni Prem, Liladar Jaguri for her work, Jitne Log Utni Prem, Liladar Jaguri. Saad Hariri stepped down as the PM of which country? He was a PM of Lebanon. Saad Hariri stepped down as the PM of Lebanon. Who has set a world record to summit the world's 14 highest peak within a span of six months and six days. She is from Nepal. She is Nirmala Purja, a Nepalese climber. Nirmala Purja. Which state has recently enacted a law on contract farming? It is Tamil Nadu. Remember, it is the first 
such law enacted in India. Recently, Nanamal, Nanamal passed away. She was a yoga teacher. She was 2019 Padma Sri Awardee. World's first country which started blockchain-based carbon trading exchange, that is Singapore. Which airline has depicted a cone car symbol on its aircraft to commemorate Guru Nanak's 50th birthday? That is Air India. Third Global Ayurveda Summit 2019 will be held in Kochi. Which Indian sand artist has been selected for Italian Golden Sand Artist Award 2019? It is Sudarshan Padnayak is an Padma Sri Awadi. Thank you. Watch it again. Learn it and memorize. I will be coming back soon with a new video. Stay tuned. Bye-bye.